Hey guys, Nightfall here, and today was supposed to be an amazing day, because today is the day that Ranked released on X Defiant. Even after last night's rage-inducing session, which if you haven't seen my video about leveling up the new assault rifle, you should go check that out on my channel, but I got a good night's sleep, woke up, got a shower, refreshed, all ready to try out this new Ranked game mode, I even tempered my expectations a little, because I knew everyone was going to be in bronze from the start, and it was probably going to be a little bit more than just normal sweaty. But boy was I in for a rude awakening. So a little recap of last night. I was playing, I was leveling up the new assault rifle, and I just couldn't get any kills at all. So I stopped leveling up that gun at level 30, and after making that video and giving my opinion on it, I loaded back into another game with my normal loadout just to see if it was the gun's fault, but no, I, I was still struggling to go positive along with the rest of my team. Meanwhile, the other team's top three players over here going 37 and 8, 32 and 9, 28 and 10. The game felt perfectly fine at launch. In fact, it felt great. I was out there dropping 50 kill games like I normally do, but then that major Xbox outage hit and I got kicked off the game. So I moved over to my PC, played a few games on there while I waited, maybe more than a few, and it took a while for Xbox to get their shit together. But everything felt okay while I was playing on PC and I wasn't playing super great, but I was still holding down close to a, a 1.5 to a 2.0 KD most games. Then Xbox came back up and I hopped on and it seemed like Everything went to hell in a handbasket. I couldn't go positive to save my life. So I thought, well, maybe everyone's on right now. All the pros, all the sweats, getting ready for ranked. I, I don't know, just trying to make some sense of it. So back to present time, I jump in, I'm playing ranked, and I quickly start to realize that nothing has changed from last night. And it's even more annoying now because it's in ranked and because everyone's using an ACR. Everyone. So I eventually said, if you can't beat them, join them. So I swapped over to my ACR build and nothing really changed. Kept playing, I kept dying to their ACRs, but no one's dying to mine. But somehow, some way, in our very first ranked game, we were about to edge out a victory. So I started thinking to myself, well, it, it is ranked. I'm not playing for kills, I have about 20 something, so it's not too bad, and we're going to win. And then boom, disaster Easy. strikes. My Rainbow Six Siege PTSD kicks in, and immediately jumped to thinking, someone just DDoS this server. And for those that don't know, a DDoS attack is just a cyber attack where they flood a bunch of packets to a server and crash it and the game just ends and doesn't ever count as a win or a loss it's almost like it didn't happen so i closed my game reopened it and while i was waiting for it to load i was scrolling through twitter and i saw this tweet from mark rubin stating that the delta 24 crashes will be patched cool ptsd panic attack stopped i start loading into a game and then Something in my brain clicked, and I, I had to do a double take at this tweet. And I read it wrong the first time. He's talking about the patch today. It's going to be fixed today, or it was fixed today. Like, the patch that went into effect as they added ranked into the game. Which means, either it wasn't fixed, because I wouldn't have got this error, or one of these four hooligans crashed that server. This is going to be an absolute nightmare if people can just cry about losing, crash the server, and move on to the next game like nothing happened. It's going to ruin ranked in weeks. Hell, it ruined Siege's ranked for a long time. That game almost died because of it. Luckily, I did test out the leaving before a game ends just to see if they had countermeasures in place to stop people from leaving and trying to negate any RP that they were going to lose. And from what I can tell, it does count as a loss when it comes to your rank, and you do lose RP. Not sure if this is actually being tracked as a loss on your in-game win-loss stat, or on tracker.gg. I'll have to do more testing on that. 
But if you aren't running an ACR and bunny hopping, <laughs> you might as well just stay out of ranks because that's all it is right now. It's so sad because I really wanted to play ranked, even though I knew weeks ago it was going to be like this because when you go into ranked, your input based matchmaking is just turned off. Doesn't apply. Meaning you're going up against PC players on mouse and keyboard who are just apparently pro movement players with 50 extra HP because that's what it feels like. I'm really not sure what's going on with this game right now. I have a hard time believing it's me. Maybe it is. You know, even though someone's going to comment skill issue, you know, I average 30 some kills per game and I know that's by no means the best. But I'm not getting anywhere close to that right now in ranked or unranked. Everything just feels weird, but I'll talk more about that in my state of the game video, which should be out either later tonight or tomorrow. So keep an eye out for that. And there is a lot to talk about because this game feels more broken now than ever before. But before I completely chalk ranked up as an L, I wanted to rule out one more thing. So I went into my Xbox settings, turned off crossplay and loaded up X Defiant. Waited about four minutes to find a game, but did finally manage to get in one and played it through just to see how it went. And what I found was there was no difference. So it's it's not the PC players invading our lobbies. It's something is going on with the game or with me because I'm still struggling to stay positive on my KD. Same two top players on the other team dropping 30 plus kills and not dying more than 10 times. And I just, I don't know what it is. The only two things that I know for sure and can accurately say that have changed since I started playing yesterday morning when the new season came out and I was doing completely fine is that one, I played a lot on my PC yesterday. And that was solely due to having the Xbox outage and not being able to play for a while. In those games, I still use the controller, so it's not like I use a different input or anything. But I do remember when I played on my PC last time, I watched my skill rating drop about 800 points in three games. I went from about 1900 to 1100. The second thing is my skill rating used to hover just below 2000. And now, as you can see here, it's just above it. So this starts to make me wonder, is skill based matchmaking really happening in the background? Are they lying to us? I need to figure out a surefire way to test this somehow. And I know this isn't a foolproof test, but if I go into a few games and purposefully throw and get my skill rating back under 2000 and then all of a sudden things just feel right again and I'm dropping 50 kills a game. It's going to be awfully suspicious, but until then, good luck to everyone in ranked. I truly, truly hope your experience is much better than mine. And maybe it's just a me problem. Maybe I'm getting bad teammates. Maybe I'm playing like trash. I, I don't know, but I think I need a break from ranked for at least a week and maybe the game in general, if things don't change soon. But as always, if you're not subscribed, I'd really appreciate it if you hit that subscribe button and I will catch you in the next one.